And, and we're taking you on a zip trip to Gaffney this morning. Let's check in now with 7 News' Christine Scarpelli. She's live at Jolly Park in Gaffney with a look at the hey Peach guys. Festival, which kicks off tonight. Such a party. Such a party. This is so exciting. We've got a lot to cover in this one, guys. Keep up with us. Okay, Peachy, you know him. I'm introducing him again. He dances. Didn't know that, but thank you. Chris Garlock showing us that Peachy dances. He's going to be playing on the stage right to his right. We're in Jolly Park, so remember to come see him. couple exciting things going on today. Sandra, we're going to get to the arts and crafts in just a second, but Jessica, i got to start with you, girl. You have prepared, so, and then maybe not you, right? We have some secret preparers of these delicious desserts. What is photo photographer Ryan showing us right now? That is a uh, peach pudding. Mm, that looks fantastic. I didn't even know peach pudding was a thing. Next yeah. to the pudding, this is probably the most amazing thing I've ever heard of. What's in there? Peach cobbler pound cake. Okay, I love cobbler. I love pound cake and peaches. Put them all together. That sounds like a winner to me. But why do we want to win? What is the contest happening later today? So today, and it's a free contest, you come in, bring in your desserts by 3.30 at the Visitor Center in Gaffney. Okay. And first place, you will get a $150 check. Second place, you'll get a $100 check. And third place, you'll get a $50 check and a plaque with each uh, first, second, and third on How the much blacks. money do you win for first place? $250. $250? Right. You can show up with your award-winning dessert, enter right there at 4 o'clock across the street from Jolly Park. Unbelievable, Jessica. Okay, you got some winners here. I think they look pretty good, but I'm not the judge. I just love to eat. Sandra, we're we going to get to eat afterwards. We'll get to eat. And that's true. We're gonna All taste. the desserts can be, we're going to share them Very after good. we get through and you'll be able to, everybody get to taste. Now, arts and crafts, I want to show okay. all of our viewers, if they are just loving this beautiful wreath in front of them, where can they find you this weekend? Because you made that. Well, I'll be around, but the crafts with these will be at First Baptist Church. Okay. And it's tomorrow, not today, but we have crafts in the park today and tomorrow here. And there'll be some people here in the park with crafts with the wreaths also. On display crafts, I have a couple of pieces right. of jewelry in front of us. There's some Pampered Chef items as well. They will be right here in Jolly Park, guys. Again, Chris Garlock, you got to come see him along with the beautiful ladies right here. And Peachy, so much going on for the Peach That's Festival. Right. We will send it back to you. All right. I was just like you. I didn't even know there was peach pudding, but now I'm excited. <laughs> Thanks so much, Christine. Right. And Gaffney, of course, is just our first zip trip. 7 News is visiting different cities all over our area. Our next stop is going to be Greenwood. That happens next Friday. We're going to have a closer look at what makes that town so special. It begins with Carolina Morning from 5 to 7 a.m. on 7 News and then from 7 to 9 a.m. on the CW. Then the fun continues from 9 to 10 a.m. on your Carolina. Find out more about future zip trips. Just click on Zip Trips under the News tab on WSPA.com.